Hey, greetings everyone. Uh, it's coming to my attention uh, by watching a bunch of different videos that a lot of people are using Skype uh, in multiplayer games so that everybody on the team can communicate. And it works pretty good, except uh, from what I've been hearing, the scenario basically goes something like this. You've got everybody in the multiplayer game and everybody's logged in and then somebody makes the Skype call and you answer the call and you go back into the game and no sound. And so you minimize the game, you go back into your volume settings, you check everything, and you've got the volume way down for your game sound. And you're thinking to yourself, why does Skype keep doing all this? Well, the uh, thing is, it's not actually Skype that's doing it. It's actually a setting in Windows that's doing that, and it's really easy to change, and you won't ever have to ma mess with your volume settings again. And I'll show you how to do that. You go into Start, Control Panel, Hardware and Sound, and under the Sound option, you go to Manage Audio Devices, and you'll have a window something like this come up, and then the last tab should be Communications, and when Windows detects communications activity, like from Skype or another Windows telephony program, basically what it's set to do by default is reduce the volume of other sounds by 80%. So that's why your volume goes all wonky when a call comes in. And so all you have to do to change that is just click on Do Nothing and hit OK, and you're done. And you never have to worry about your volume settings changing again. And, uh, you know, you've, you've got your Skype problem solved. So if anybody, uh, you know, is having this problem or you know anybody else that's having this problem, um, be sure to pass this video along to them. I'd appreciate it. And I'd also appreciate a like and uh, possibly a subscribe, too. Well, thanks very much.